between Animal House and the Black Eyes and Alliances. Animal House representatives later released an official statement indicating that the conduct of the Black Horizons Commander-in-Chief, Horizons, was the primary catalyst for their actions. Local communication nets recorded frantic broadcasts from the Black Horizons leadership to the Animal House representatives after the first waves of destroy mission fleets struck their holdings. These calls for information were met with complete silence from the Animal House representatives for some time, demonstrating that this was no mere accident or careless effort. Animal House forces completely ignored both of the Black Horizons Gathan and Galen fortresses and instead struck planetary targets with relentless force. In tandem with Animal House's secondary and tertiary destroy missions, the disavowed alliance launched their offensive against the Black Horizon fortresses. Andros, commander-in-chief of disavowed, noted his surprise at the speed and ease at which the Black Horizons fortress defenses were annihilated. Seen congratulating his officers after the decisive victory at the Gathan Fortress, disavowed forces moved on to the Galen Fortress and yet again repeated a strong showing. While the Black Horizons commanders would not comment on the losses, it is to be expected that some of their defense fleets were recalled for planetary defenses as the fortresses did not seem to be primary targets at the time. In a moment of confusion and alarm, a Cygnus Alliance officer initiated a rally point offensive against Animal House's Kalan Fortress. Animal House representatives were quick to determine that this action was taken by one of the Cygnus Alliance's chiefs, Boba Fett, who acted on his own, without authorization or the presence of the Cygnus commander. Once the Cygnus commander, Viper 24 was in a position to contact his subordinates, he was quick to countermand the order and the rally point was cancelled. While showing a clear disagreement with the questionable actions of his officer, Viper 24 has affirmed a neutral stance for Cygnus in regards to the war. This marks yet another embarrassment for Boba Fett, commented an Animal House representative. Days after the initial war declaration by Animal House, the conquest of the Black Horizon holdings have yet to show any sign of relenting. Local net broadcasts noted Animal House representatives and the Black Horizon commander in extended conversations on open channels. Witnesses note that the Animal House representatives' calm tenacity and diplomacy eventually wore down Horizons as posturing to the point where he admitted to the behaviors Animal House first cited as the reasons for the war. When contacted for further details about this turn of events, Animal House representatives were quick to make assurances that those admissions had no bearing on a continuation of their war effort, and that it would indeed continue. Earlier today, the Black Horizons commander finally withdrew from the war effort for the day citing the fact that his forces had been completely decimated. The ship loss count for all sides involved has been substantial, which is projected to cause ship manufacturing component stocks to spike. Despite initial estimates that put Animal House at a disadvantage in terms of territory, nearly 2 to 1 against, their forces and additional allies have shown considerable strength. While the territorial tug of war continues, it is clear that the Black Horizons has lost far more territory than Animal House. Comparing statistics as it stands now, the Black Horizons is down from 135 planets to 66, while Animal House is down from 71 planets to 63. The Black Horizons members have continued to put on a brave face in public channels, at least those who spent any time speaking to the public. However, they have also seen an exodus of active members leaving the Alliance due to the failure of the war, losing a total of 13 supporters, nearly one quarter of their charter. Animal House members have been showing very strong optimism and pride in their work, as well as quick to compliment their allies. Animal House representatives shared this. We are very happy with how things have gone, and Disavowed has shown masterful command in executing their attacks. The Entity Alliance, Stars Alliance, Federation Alliance, and other major alliances have remained out of the fighting for the time being, with little comment to the public. This has been your Light of Nova Galactic News broadcast. Good hunting.